Social distancing will eventually end, but Brazil is here to stay. Brazil is a virtual reality sports technology training platform. So it's designed to not only show and train certain characteristics of the game, but it's also meant to train the brain. Uh, thus the name Brazil came from resiliency. Designed in 2017 in the UK, Christian Barsanti, one of the creators, says the cutting edge technology was initially created to train elite injured players during rehab. Utilized by clubs like Manchester United, Manchester City and Liverpool, Brazil came to the US in 2019. Then the pandemic hit. The big appeal, it is socially distanced training. You don't need much. You need um, the goggles, 10 feet, you're good to go. And you can go ahead and put it on and you can get those touches in. You're going to have a headset and these are called base stations and they set the environment and you'll see it later, but you're going to see the whole soccer pitch and it all comes from these base stations. It's really amazing stuff. You're going to have feet trackers as well. United Keeper Academy in Franklin Lakes, New Jersey is one of three North Jersey athletic groups implementing this virtual training as Sarah Mantilla from Fairlawn High School and Christina Rigo from Dwight Englewood demonstrate. Brazil has different levels of drills, some replicating real game situations and real players. It also provides data assessing anything from an athlete's physical and mental sharpness to an injured player's rehab progress. What I love about it is the reaction time. We could do a lot of that reaction training outside. Um, we do a lot of service from the other kids so the kids serve the balls and it's not always perfect. I mean you'll get five or six balls hit at a goalkeeper and you know the kids are smashing them in the parking lot. With these that come in, they're getting guaranteed 100% service is accurate. Manchester, England native Glenn Walton is the director at United Keeper Academy. He says Brazil has been a lifesaver the past year, especially when his players got bored of Zoom workouts. Once this was introduced to the keepers, it put them in a whole new world, I think. And, you know, as you can see around with it, you know, the technology and the graphics, it makes them feel like they're on a training field again. I've become very curious to see how realistic this VR training is and Tara setting me up on a drill right now. You're going to have a half circle of goals in front of you. You're going to look for the highlighted ball launcher. You could take a touch, play it one time, and pass it into the highlighted goal. Do I actually feel the ball touch my foot? No. Oh, nice and clear now. Good there. I'm going to tighten it now. Just the whole reality of it is so impressive. I know my aim on these goals is completely off. <laughs> my first goal! Let's stop there. Let's stop while we're ahead. Brazil's technology propels technique and skill development much faster than traditional practicing alone. And that's a good thing because this reporter can use all the training she can get. Oops, I should have used my left foot there. In Franklin Lakes, New Jersey, Tina Servacio, Fox 5 News.